Hello and welcome to the show. Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau's mother weighed in on a viral image of First Lady Melania Trump cheek kissing him, calling it cute and dispelling rumours that interaction was anything more than friendly. In the photo from the G7 summit in France in August, the First Lady wears a red dress as she leans in and picks Trudeau while President Donald Trump looks away with a seemingly sour expression. In an interview with the Daily Beast, Margaret Trudeau, author and ex-wife of former Canadian Prime Minister Pierre Trudeau, laughed merrily about the viral photo with her son. That photo was cute, she said, pointing out the larger context of the situation. But it was one flash, one moment. A picture tells a story but doesn't tell the whole story. Donald Trump was right in front of Melania, she added. She was getting ready for a cheek peck, I guess. Margaret Trudeau said that her son Justin is a tall glass of milk and everybody likes to look at someone nice. They have met before, they have a friendship, he and Sophie, she continued, referring to her son's wife, like Melania very much. Margaret Trudeau admitted, <coughs> Margaret Trudeau admitted that she does not know the First Lady personally, but that there's an aloofness and quietness that means we don't know how much about Melania. While she saw the photo as indicative of nothing more than a friendly gesture, she admits she cannot imagine what it would be like to Donald Trump's wife and wished Melania Trump could influence the president in a positive way. I'd wish she'd talk to her husband, Margaret Trudeau said. I think she's in charge of an anti-bullying campaign. Perhaps she should share some of her wisdom with him. Referring to Melania Trump appearing to swat away the president's hand, Margaret Trudeau suggested that the first lady's role is evolving and it can even be to the husband's detriment if his wife is by his side. Sophie does not have to be at Justin's side while he campaigns if she doesn't want to, Trudeau ad Margaret Trudeau added. She elaborated that first ladies don't have to be standing next to our husband's beaming and have to be a strong woman living our own lives giving support to our partners in terms of being married to them but not being their clone or servant or responsible for what they are saying. Women are no longer simply serving but right up there at the front line, she said. Thank you.